Hello friends, welcome to my channel Creative Art. My name is Nilima and today we are going to paint this beautiful glass painting of a lady with black cat. Many different kinds of colors are used in the background and a very beautiful different texture is created in this painting specially. This is done the first time. So do observe the whole video till the end so that you may look at all the beautiful effects of this beautiful glass painting. All the materials required to make this beautiful glass painting are mentioned in the description box below as well as shown in the video. To get this image, please click on the link www.creativeathome.com which is also mentioned in the description box. So enjoy painting friends. So let's start our glass painting friends. First of all, we have taken a color photocopy and a black and white photocopy of our glass painting and now I have placed a transparent OHP sheet on our black and white photocopy and using tape, we have to secure all the four corners So here yeah, all the four corners are secured now. Now we are going to cut only the skin part of the girl, the face and only the hand and knee. Okay, so let's start cutting. So here our cutting part is completed now. So we'll apply Fevicol glue on all the corners of the piece we have cut out. So here yeah, I'm placing it exactly where. Now we'll press all the corners and we'll let it dry for at least 10 minutes. So friends, here is how uh, it looks when the whole lining part is completed. Using my cutter, I'll be removing all the four secure corners. Okay, so here I have removed all the four secure corners and you can very clearly see the lining part and as you know the hairs are really black and the remaining part of the cat color is completely black which we'll be doing at the end of the video. So now we'll start coloring our glass painting using Fevicryl glass colors which are water based and available in 10 shades. This painting is very simple friends. We have to just color the ladies dress part which will be a combination of brown, black, red and pink. The maximum combination of red and pink would be appearing in the middle part of her dress and the shadings would be in the edges itself. Okay, so let's start coloring. First of all, we'll be taking our brown color and starting it from one end. Then we'll take tomato red, mix it with brown and pull it downwards.
part completed now. So we'll color the cat hole with the black. First of all, we'll also complete the earring, which is made up of brown and red. Hold in a very dark black color. We'll also color the same black on the lady's hair. The texture of lady's hair is already made using black lining and again I am filling it up with black. glass painting finally completed now so I'll let it get dry and then I'll show you the final clip how does it looks when it gets dried up completely okay so friends here you can see that our glass painting has got dried up completely but friends this is not the final look so we are going to do something special in this glass painting so that it may look more beautiful so keep watching so friends, here is a special trick. You have to take a brush and the gold liner you know always gets end up but we won't waste it. So we'll take the remaining part in a small container. Then with the brush we'll start and give a stroke. The stroke need not be even. Okay, just give it a good stroke. If you want to continue it further, you can continue it further. Give it a good length. In the same way, you have to do this trick all over from the sides of this glass painting. This should be very light as this is just going to be the background and the lady is going to be the focus. So you have to just maintain the light path. So for this new effect, I'm also going to use a few colors. This one is a maroon color. I would advise you to use a bronze color. Okay. I do want to give it a rusty look. So I'm applying this. I actually need a brown color. And one more is this. Yeah, first of all it will be a bit messy but later on it will give a very beautiful effect and I advise you all to try this something new in your glass paintings it will look more beautiful when this get dried up here we are using acrylics okay a glitter acrylic as well as our gold liner it's a quite mixture of both
is our rusty look completed. I let it dry for a few minutes and then I'll show you the final look. So friends, here is our glass painting completed and completely dry now. This is the final look of our beautiful glass painting of lady with black cat. Now I'm going to show you some special appearances. I always ask you to do frame the glass paintings using either silver or else golden aluminium foil. For this painting, I would also recommend the same. Please do frame it using golden aluminium foil. And I'm also showing you various kind of effects using glitter sheets. This is the golden glitter sheet I have used behind it and the pink glitter sheet I'm going to use the second because this is a big painting. I don't have such big enough glitter sheets. That's why I'm showing you effects on both. This is how golden glitter sheet appears and this is how the pink glitter sheet appears and do use a golden aluminium foil for framing this beautiful glass painting with the black border to appear it look more beautiful and graceful if you did like this video friends please do like and subscribe my channel thank you for watching